The U.S. is moving thousands of its troops to Israel for a planned joint exercise. It comes against the backdrop of increasing tensions in the Persian Gulf over Iran's threat to block the crucial Hormuz Strait. Some analysts have voiced fears it could be part of a build-up to a military strike on Iran. Well, for further details, let's join our correspondent Paula Sleer. She is in Jerusalem. So these latest movements, should they be cause for concern? Well, certainly people here are concerned by the latest developments. They come at a particularly sensitive time in the region as the American President Barack Obama has signed into law sanctions that will make it very difficult for countries to buy oil from Iran. Now, what we're hearing from the Israeli military is that it will reportedly be holding its biggest military drill ever with the United States. And what's important to note is that we're not talking here of only a military exercise. We're talking about the deployment of thousands of American troops into to Israel. What we're hearing from both sides is that they will be testing various missile systems against rockets and against missiles. What we're hearing, though, from the Iranian officials is that they believe that this is the latest and most blatant sign that Israel is planning to attack Iran and attack it sometime soon. The Israelis, of course, denying this. Their announcement comes just 10 days after the Iranians held a military exercise near the crucial Strait of Hormuz, but the Israelis say that this announcement that they'll be holding, this joint exercise with the Americans, is unrelated to the Iranian exercise. But nevertheless, it does seem pretty serious when you do set it against the context of what's happening there in the Persian Gulf. G can you bring us up to date on what's the, the latest from there at the moment, Paula? Well, tensions certainly are running high here in the region. What we're hearing from Tehran is that they believe that the European Union is waging an economic war against it. And this is in light of the EU considering imposing sanctions against Iranian oil expo exports. And indeed, if this goes ahead, it could be implemented by the end of January. What we're hearing from Iran is a threat that they, in turn, will close and block the oil trade through the crucial Hormuz Strait. And they've also warned the American naval presence in and around the Persian Gulf. Certainly, Tehran is feeling the pinch of the sanctions that the international community has imposed and looking to impose against it. The Iranian currency dropped to a record low after the American president signed into law those sanctions. So what we're hearing from Iran is also that it's preparing its own naval exercises, that these exercises will go ahead soon. They're part of a series that has been dubbed the great profit. So certainly that has people both here in the region and in the international community concerned. Paula, thanks very much indeed. Uh, that's Paula Slayer live there in Jerusalem.